Hello everybody, I'm Angela here from Nishan Education Consultants Private Limited. Today I am with a good news for you all. So I am going to explain uh, some things in detail. It's about NEET 2020 for foreign education. Uh, a student called Ishika Kumari from Rajasthan has registered a case in High Court and an order was released from High Court uh, by 29th July 2020 to Medical Council of India. I'll explain you the student's case in detail. She has, she has registered herself in a medical institution in a foreign country and she wants to pursue her medicine from that institution. And she was waiting for the NEET exam. So NEET was supposed to be held in the month of May, but it was postponed due, due to this COVID situation. It was postponed to July. And then again in uh, July, this MCI and our education minister has postponed the NEET exam again to September 13th. She was very much prepared to write the exam in the month of July. Because of the postponed, she has registered a case that I cannot wait anymore because I, I have applied for a foreign medical institution. I was supposed to complete my education process in the month of August by the end of August. So the student was very anxious and she has clearly mentioned that I cannot be able to wait till 13th of September because this uh, foreign medical institution has asked me to start the classes from September 1st. If the need is compulsory to go to abroad, I cannot able to take my medical career this year. I will lose one year uh, for sure. So kindly exempt this need for another one year. This is her. Uh, query. So now this High Court has given a notice to MCI on 29th saying that this student's query is really reasonable and it should be considered seriously. And uh, they have, uh, the High Court has given them three weeks time to consider the situation and replay her with the eligibility certificate. So now after three weeks, MCI has taken another five days to replay this uh, notice and today 25th August they have uh, answered the student as well as the high court that this uh, year if the student is not having any more time to wait the student can write in the next year she can go take her admission in the proposed university she can continue her studies she can complete one year of education and she can come back in the year 2021 that is next year and she can write her exam this is the replay so now uh, any students in that notice itself in the, if you see the notice second point sub point 13 there will be a notice that any such students who is willing to pursue can do the same like Ishika Kumari. If you are a student who is willing to take your medical education abroad, you can also do the same procedure. You can either write in 2020 or 21 and clear your need and you are always welcome to write the screening test and register yourself as a doctor. If you do not uh, pass the exam either in 2020 or 2021, your medical registration will not be allowed after completing the course. That is the replay. Uh, in detail. So kindly parents and students note this point. You got one year to prepare yourself. If you are not confident about the need, if you cannot pass your need uh, in the first attempt that is 2020, if you are not confident, please take up one year, take any foreign medical education and uh, continue your one year study. After your one year study, you can come back and write your exam in 2021. This is the final advice from Nishan Education and the explanation of Medical Council of India. So we are luckily got a new way to achieve our medical career. So kindly parents and students take up this option as a uh, serious thing, consider it, meditate upon it and kindly take a good decision because there is always a good proverb, there is, where there is a will, there is always a way. So now Ishika Kumari, one single student, she got the will to find a new way. She got a new way. So I believe that you are all such students. She was mostly, I, I can say that 10 lakh in one. She is 10 lakh in one student who has applied such a uh, bold case and got a bold answer right now. And of course, there is one more thing I wanted to tell you. This student, Ishika Kumari, could apply again to High Court that she cannot wait upon this kind of scenario like I cannot write in 2020, I cannot either write in 2021, you cancel it for me this year. She could ask that. If she do that, 
I think there will be one year complete exemption for everybody. But it is her decision, we do not know. So this is like future tense. What I am explaining is a future happening. It's not uh, decided yet. It is solely dependent on the child. So she will either decide to take up this one year as a good option or she could again write it to Supreme Court that she, she cannot accept this as a good option. So kindly parents and students, I think she is really capable of becoming a doctor because she is already fighting. Please make sure you also fight for what you want and achieve it. God bless you all and really I wish you all very good success and again, please don't miss this chance. Thank you. Many of you dream to study MBBS in abroad, but low marks in need is stopping you? And worried about the budget too? No need to pay donations for private medical colleges anymore. Choose Russia and Armenia to achieve your dreams. Pay only 20 to 25 lakhs for 5.6 years of studies, including hostel facilities. Nishin is the best consultant in South India, with 20 years worth of experience and 11 branch offices. Handled by highly experienced counsellors, Choose the best consultant for better future and professional service. Nishin has made more than 3,000 doctors working across the globe successfully. Today's students, tomorrow's doctors. Nishin Educational Consultants, Private Limited.